the snap. Satcher, the running back. They play fake it to him. Swing it out over to the left side. That ball's caught by Becchio. He breaks the tackle with the 50. Down to the 40, and Vecchio sliding his way down to the 32-yard line where he's met by Ryan Weber. Right there, and that's what Malone was able to do. Colonials running a jet sweep left to right. Here it goes, 30, 25, down to the 20-yard line, and taking off flying with that football that time was Trey Edwards. Colonials tighten up on offense now. Roman Jack under center. Here's a toss sweep. Satcher turning the left side corner. Jamming it into the end zone. Touchdown, Robert Morris as he takes it in from seven yards away. And the first thing I did was look for a flag. There are none <laughs> to be found. And that is a standing touchdown there as the Colonial score with 6.13 to go on a sweep to the left side by Dante Satcher here in the first period of play. Connor Shenning comes on to kick. Colonial's counting bodies out there, making sure they have enough. And apparently they do. Snap, placement, check is the holder. Shannon puts it up into the scoreboard end of the stadium and jams it into the lights. That is Joe Malone. Ayakuchi with a two-step drop. Pressure's on him. He's going to be hit and sacked. He looked downfield, couldn't find anybody open. Wide receiver to the right as well. Play fake, Ayakuchi back to pass. Throws long down the sideline. He's got a man streaking downfield. Making the over the shoulder catch at the 30 yard line and finally being dragged down at around the 15. It appeared to be Ashton Doolin who hauled that in. Drew Allen tackled him from behind, catching up to him, saving the TD. Boy, what a beautiful pass by that quarterback, Chris. They tell you, as a quarterback, well, they never told me, but they tell quarterbacks, put air in the knee to the right hand sign. Back to pass, looking, Ayakuchi hit, bounces through, finds a hole, goes to the 10, cuts far side, tripped up at the seven yard line. This will be a 26 yard attempt, the angle right to left from the hash mark, it is up and it is good and Malone is on the board. Malone showing some heat from the corners. Coming after Barr in his first action, he's able to evade them, rolling to the right, now tucking and running, he's up to the 30, he'll take a hit at the 32 yard line and go down hard, third down. Barr gets the snap, two-step drop, fires out left side off his back foot. That ball is caught, and on the run is Vecchio. He slants to the boundary line and gets the first down. Two tight ends in for Robert Morris, and Satcher again will run, and he couldn't find anything up the middle. He tried to turn to the left, and wasn't even Satcher. It's Barr. Barr kept the football and faked everybody out, including the voice of the Colonials, <laughs> as he takes it down to the 14-yard line. Jordan Johnson was able to find him and stop him. It sure as heck looked like Satcher was carrying that football to the left. And it was indeed. And is set as a receiver just off the line of scrimmage. Play fake, Barr looking, firing, end zone! Touchdown, Robert Morris. Warren Robinson running a slant to the post. And the Colonials are on the board again. What an absolutely great drive by the Robert Morris offense, led by Matthew Barr, getting his first taste of the 2016 season, Chris. 12 plays, 75 yards, 628 it took on that drive, Chris, and it was refreshing for me to see an offense hands on their hips out of breath because that was the longest scoring drive of Robert Morris on the season. Connor Shannon for the point after. Al is the quarter is the punter rather, and he bangs it tall and deep. Warren Robinson circles under it at the 26, comes near side 30. Juke step 35 40, makes a cut to the 45 50, makes another cut down to the 45 and ahead to the 41 yard line. Here's the snap, placement is down, Moeller puts his foot into it, it travels the distance, it's end over end, and it is perfectly through the pipe. Ready to take the snap, he has an H back in front of him, a tail back behind him. Two step drop, looks up, steps up, now he's gonna be hit by G Stanley and drilled into the turf at the mm. 31 yard line. You know, that he set 1998, and boy, when Coach Ferrison dials up his number, Chris, I don't think there's anybody that could stop him. Scal punts the ball all the way down to the 19-yard line. Here comes Warren Robinson back up the field over the 25-30. Cuts far side, 35. Juke step, 40. Cuts back up the middle, 45-50. Breaks a tackle at the 40, down to the 30, to the 20. One man to beat. He's at the 10, the 5. Touchdown! Warren Robinson unofficially an 81-yard punt return for Robert Morris. 81 yards, Chris, and I am scouring the field looking for a flag. I don't see it. Warren Robinson showing why last year, Chris, he was one of the most electric, fine punt returners in the entire nation. Not only FCS, but FBS. So he's able to show his magic right there. Second touchdown on the night for Warren Robinson. 
What a great bring back that was by Warren Robinson from the 19. Now, Connor Shannon is on to put the extra point through if he can. He has it lined up. Adam checked with the hold, and the kick is on its way. It is tall. It's end over end, and it is good. What a slop man in Stotts. Here's the snap, and a rush is on, and a screen pass is set to the right side, and the big fullback is coming out of the backfield. He's going to go inside the 15, down to the 10, down to the 5. He's in for the touchdown. Mm. That's Matt Blasioli. Iacucci throwing a fade down the right side, and this one is going to be broken up and intercepted, perhaps. And it is intercepted by the Colonials. Left on an island because you had trips the other side, Chris. Oh, Drew Allen with a great job getting a quick little jam, turning, running with him, opening up, and able to become a wide receiver instead of a defensive back, making a great play on the ball, diving low, comes away with the interception, getting Robert Morris back the ball. Slightly overthrown Drew Allen in perfect position to make the catch, and now the Colonials trying to run it out of there. Dante Satcher has run to the sideline. He's going to lose a couple of yards. All of a sudden, the Malone defense has come alive. That's a lot of pressure on Malone. Here he is, Ayacuchi throwing end zone, and the ball is going to be broken up, incomplete. Three receivers to the left side this time for the Pioneers. Ayacuchi gets the snap, gives off. Blasioli trying to run it left. He's chopped down at the two. Gets it. Fires. End zone. Touchdown. Wow. Ayacuchi going for the tie. Snap. Ayacuchi looking left. Throws. End zone. Doolin. Oh. 